Hey guys, back to Horsemanship here, just reminding you that there are no rules saying that you can't halter a haltered horse. And the reason you might do that is I've got this little horse here and he's kind of a worried type. Um, for, he kind of is a bit of a freezer, but especially with this halter on the right ear, he gets real worried. And what he'll sometimes do is just walk off. And if I don't already have him haltered, um, it's real hard to get him back right there. Whereas if I've already got him haltered, what I can do is just kind of do a bit of a reset, remind him that everything's okay here. And then we can do this with this halter again and basically get that good to where I don't end up kind of following him around the pen and getting it in his head that he might be getting chased because I really don't want that. Um, so haltering a haltered horse can sometimes be the best way to get them good at the haltering process. And then with one that's a little funny around their ears, I really, really encourage having a quick release, not like this, so that you can be, um, if you had to get this undone really quickly, you could. I'm being really quiet about it, but ooh, easy. One that's a little worried like this, good. You can kind of get it on and off um, without having to sit there and be real clumsy. You're all right, big guy. I know. Got the wave. Got the wave. Them boys. 